So then I would like to continue now with some maps on uh, the different regions and where to find them in Germany. So maybe starting in the south from Lake Constant northwards, we find viticulture mainly in areas which are seeded along the major rivers and which is first of all the Rhine along the Rhine from south to north. We find several different wine growing regions but then it's also the Moselle or the Main, which is actually a region of important wine growing. Furthermore, in eastern Germany, it's also along the river Saale-Unstrut and along the Elbe, where we find viticulture. What are the main German wine growing regions or what is the surface of viticulture in Germany as such. So we have in Germany around about 103,000 hectares of viticulture. It divides more or less well into two-third white varieties and one-third red varieties. Nevertheless, that share is specifically dependent on the different regions um, that we have here in Germany. While looking at numbers, Rheinhessen is with 26,582 hectares, the biggest wine growing region in Germany, followed by the Pfalz, just south of it, um, which is around 23,567,000 hectares. And then furthermore, we have Baden, uh, more southwards, um, at the border towards France, towards Alsace, and in the south towards Switzerland, with 15,822 hectares, and Württemberg um, with 11,373 hectares. Smaller in number, but quite well known internationally, is the Mosul um, with 8,776 hectares, and like Rheingau um, with its three. 1166 hectares. We will discover it later on a bit more in detail and talk a bit more specifically about the conditions here. Besides that regions we also have Franken or Franconia along the mine um, with a bit more than 6000 hectares and followed then by Nahe region with a, bit, a little bit more than 4000 hectares and smaller but also really interesting um, viticulture areas like DR with just 560 hectares or Mittelrhein or um, Hessische Bergstraße or Saale Unstrut and Sachsen. While looking here at that map we get an indication what are the main varieties or the, the major varieties for that specific regions. While looking at the Mosel and Rheingau and some other regions like Pfalz, it gets clear that Riesling is here the major white variety um, and for sure it is the most important white German variety. Nevertheless, we find also a share of other varieties um, and then specifically looking at um, different um, regions in Germany. We also see that, for example, the R or Württemberg is more coined by red varieties than by whites. So the R, really unique region when it comes to Pinot Noir, but also uh, Frühburgunder or called Pinot Precoce uh, as rarity from, from that region. Württemberg, where we have um, quite important plantations of Pinot Meunier, but also Blaufränkisch or Pinot Noir, the same uh, counts for Baden, where we have the biggest share in terms of red for Pinot Noir. 